your weather bug forecast from coast to coast on this Saturday. I'm meteorologist Gretchen Mishik. We're checking out the view out of Jenks, Oklahoma from earlier this morning as the sun was coming up. Showers and thunderstorms impacting the area. This isn't far from the Tulsa area. We've already had rain moving through, but it certainly isn't over yet. More rain will be impacting portions of Oklahoma. And in fact, it's a broad area that will be extending from Nebraska all the way down through Texas. Storms in this region have the potential of becoming severe, especially throughout the afternoon and into the evening hours. The severe threat for tomorrow will continue to advance eastward and actually intensify a bit. Although the area may become a bit smaller, we have an enhanced risk for stronger storms across portions of Arkansas and into Louisiana. On the back side of this system, it's the winter weather that we're actually dealing with. So portions of the Rockies still picking up a couple inches of snow with winter storm warnings impacting portions of Colorado. So as we set our forecast into motion, moisture from the central plains moves towards the Ohio River Valley into Sunday with the ground so saturated flooding may continue to be a concern places like Kentucky and then that rain will continue to lift northward into the northeast as we head into the second half of the weekend showers and a few rumbles of thunder may also impact portions of the upper Midwest so plenty of rain especially for the eastern half of the nation temperatures across the country today look something like this it's Certainly warm throughout the Ohio River Valley. Numbers in these areas are running about 10 degrees warmer than average. 60s in Chicago, 70 as far north as Minneapolis, but staying in the 50s in the Denver area. Up to 90 in Phoenix. Storms down to, towards New Orleans. We're up to 81 today in the Dallas area and topping out at 86 in Miami.